Okay, I figured it might be fun to record some first impressions on this new design uh, and prototyping tool called PenPot. Uh, so here we are. Uh, I just set up an account. We got my email address verified and I'm in the system. And so far, so good. I really love the, the aesthetic. I, I love the <laughs> the seafoam neon green color palette and the kind of the illustrations all around. You see this on their marketing site too. Um, so, you know, here it is, alpha release. I'll click continue. Open source contributor. Penpot is open source. Very cool. All uh, right. I'll, I'm liking this too. I'm liking how it's already prompting, um, you know, for how, how to get involved, how to contribute to it. It's very community minded. Okay. Design library styles and components. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I mean, that's, that's what I'm looking for. Interesting. I'm curious how the interact interaction uh, functionality holds up. Yeah, and this this is surprisingly frustrating uh, that tools like Zeppelin and Figma uh, aren't better at this. So I'm really curious to see how they handle commenting. Yeah, and that this too, this is like the holy grail, right? Of um, information architecture to uh, design to development is this one shared source of truth. So we'll, we'll see. I won't be too hard on it since it's alpha, but you know. Okay, supports teams, that's nice. Um, let's avoid that for now though. All right. Um, I'm tempted to check out the design system as an example. Oh, I'm super tempted, but let's just start a new file and see what happens. Okay. Uh, so we have a page here. Yeah, I'll have to get kind of familiar with the level of granularity and the concepts. Okay, so I just hit the A button because that's what I'm used to in Figma and sketch oh sweet okay so they have the same concept okay this is great all right so let's see can i double click this to rename it no can i double click here okay that's fine uh let's call this home page yeah and um what what does v do okay this is around um other keyboards Ellipsis, uh -huh. E for that, R for rectangle. Okay, cool. Um, all right, so let's, ooh, nice. Snaps into position. Okay, I'm really liking this already. And let's call this the header. So far it's very familiar. Um, it, well, very similar to Sketch and Figma. If, if you use those tools, this should be familiar to you. Um, can we duplicate? We can duplicate. Okay. I just did control D. Yeah. So very, very similar. Okay. Click and drag this around. Ah, uh huh. Okay. Uh, somehow. Oh, I see. Okay. So we, we do want this in here. What? Okay, this is, eh, there we go. Um, what else can we do? Some ellipsis, let's see how that goes. Uh -huh. And T for text, yep, all right. Hello, welcome to my new website. All right, this, this is all looking familiar. Hmm, what else? I wonder if they have an idea. 
let's see how do the how do the comments work and then if I create another artboard and I create another comment what about this hmm mm -hmm. And then what does this do? Resolve it? Okay. Ah. Uh, uh huh. Okay, okay. Cool. Well, I'm, yeah. Oh, we can throw in an image. All right. And I guess V back to. Or what is this? How do we get back to this move? Anyway, moving this around. Yeah, I mean, so far this is very easy to work with. Very smooth experience. Yeah, this is nice. A lot of the kind of effects that you would expect with a prototyping tool A history. Oh, that's nice. Wow, this is a lot going on for an alpha release. This is much more than I expected. So, what does this do? This path. Okay. And then, anyway. Okay. Well. I think I'll stop this video for now. Um, so far, first impressions, I'm really liking what I'm seeing. Um, yeah, it feels a lot like Figma um, and Sketch, and is but is open source, which is great. Um, so yeah, I uh, might make a few more of these videos in the future. Um, but for now, um, I encourage people to check it out. You can check it out at um, penpot.app, I think. Yeah, it's free. So give it a spin if you like it. You know, leave a positive review in Product Hunt. If you don't like it, I guess, you know, leave a review there too. Constructive feedback is always good for people. Uh, thanks for watching.